Gentlemen, once you move forward, the path of strictest honesty is the only way. And if somebody wakes up and suddenly goes on a sports stadium for concerts, what kind of uh, reasoning is this? Seriously, you close on a sports room to pay for concerts, to raise money, to meet a stadium. So, okay, raise the money. Meet a stadium for what event? Sports or more concerts? What is the logic here? And we sit down and not complain. Why are we afraid of the truth? Why? I mean, this is stinks for me, it stinks. It makes me feel ashamed that we can close on a sports stadium mm -hmm. when the league is on. Meanwhile, this, this device was primarily built for sports, in fact, for football. And you close it down to host a concert, everybody's happy. Pat. It hurts. For me as a Ghanaian, it hurts me. Not because of hard work. But to take decisions like we are thinking upside down. And journalists, hmm? if anybody to be blamed, it's more you. Because you are the ones who must comment on things like this. But you all have got quiet. Why do we sit down and allow evil to conquer us? Why? Evil gets done when good men stay silent. How can you close the whole stadium down? And now they mess up the pitch. Any money they make up maybe may not even be enough to restore what is destroyed. You see that? Didn't you see it? Wasn't it looking odd? Or did it look odd? Yes. So why did you quiet? Why did you quiet? Hmm? These are the things that our supporters must focus on. Absolutely. This one has supporters must focus on. We don't own the pitch. That's true. But that's the pitch we have. You see what I'm saying? That's why others elsewhere use government owned pitches. Why do you consistently deny us of this for our pitch? Why not other pitches? They don't watch concerts. 